The mass amount indicates how many protons and neutrons an atom contains. Mass number equals the number of protons plus the number of neutrons. This could also be written with the equation A equals Z plus N. Z equals the atomic number. N equals number of neutrons. A equals mass number. Let's make a new chart, this time with headlines atomic type, atomic number, protons, neutrons, and mass number. One proton weighs one U, and one neutron also weighs one U. The electron's mass is so small that it is not included. The first substance in the periodic system is hydrogen. It has the atomic number one. That means that it has one proton. You will find the atomic mass at the bottom of the elements box. For hydrogen, it is 1008. The difference between the mass number and the atomic number is the number of neutrons. This means that there are no neutrons in a hydrogen atom because the atomic number and mass number are the same. In the chart, number 1 is written below the atomic number. The number 1 is also written under the number of protons, since it is the same as the atomic number. Because there are no neutrons in hydrogen, the number 0 is written below neutrons. The number of protons plus number of neutrons equals mass number. Therefore, the hydrogen's mass number is 1. The next element in the chart is helium. In the periodic system, one can see that helium has the atomic number 2. The number of protons are the same as the atomic number. The number of neutrons is the difference between the atomic's mass and the atomic number. Since 4 minus 2 equals 2, the core of a helium consists of two neutrons. Mass number equals number of protons plus number of neutrons. Therefore, the mass number for helium is 4. In order to describe an atom, you first write the symbol. For oxygen, this is O. At the top left, you write the mass number. Notice that in the periodic system, it is rather the atomic number that is written at the top left corner. In the lower left corner, the atomic number is written. Are you interested in learning and watching more 3D animated videos? Go to keplerlearning.se or our page on udemy.com. Links can be found in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and click the like button.